Welcome to Harlem. <laughs> Hello, Hello, welcome. Welcome to Harlem. How are you? I'm fine. How are you? Doing wonderfully. I need to know what do you do for a living? I do lots for a living as I'm a concierge, a man of all trades. Oh. Uh, I work at a hotel downtown. Okay, nice. Yes. I guess you meet a lot of different people. Um, I meet all shapes and sizes. Uh, what is uh, the most annoying people that you meet for your job? Um, oh my goodness. Uh, the most annoying people are American Express concierge, which I get to speak to on a daily basis. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Now, I want to, I see you have a good personal style. Thank you very One much. One thing that represents your personal style. Ah, uh, follow me. Yes, we love <laughs> it. Uh, what questions are, are you tired of answering that tourists ask you too much? Um, where is the sightseeing, like, hop on, hop off bus? Because it's like, you can see them, they're giant big buses in the city, like, I don't need to tell you things that you can look up on Google. <laughs> um, so the bow tie is for sure what represents my personal oh, style the most. Nice. Um, always in bright colors and patterns. Very so cute. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what kind of celebrities are visiting your hotel? Um, you know, very high profile people. Mm -hmm. These days, maybe not so much the uh, types that are major A-list celebrities they come to, but more so like fashion execs, smart photographers, okay. things like that. So where would you send them if they ask you to... Uh, to right now, because it's always changing in New York City, the hot place I think is Vandal. Um, it's a cool new like restaurant club that's in the Lower East Side. Okay. It's inspired with uh, sort of street art and then street food. So it's sort of a fusion of both. Can um, anyone get in there or do you have Not to... at all. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. It is very busy in, in a tricky so spot. So you have to plan it. And you have no to plan it or know um, a, you. a good concierge. <laughs> okay. uh, what, is, what are you most proud of owning here? Um, what am I most proud of owning? Yeah. For sure, my beloved record player. Um, which I've owned since college and as I'm a theater guy and never really got to know popular music It's been my gateway to like 70s 60s rock and discovering all these new artists and stuff What is the difference between the concierge team and the private team? Concierge Tim is always very put together as is private Tim mm. um, But I would say you know more so concierge Tim is out to impress you give you nothing but sweetness and kindness and friendly smiles and I can be a little bit of a bitch sometimes in <laughs> my real life. But all professional. All, when you're, yeah. Always professional and happy. Uh, uh, like, uh, what's, what's the gayest thing you have? The gayest thing I have? Yeah? Oh my god, there's so many things. Okay, let's see. I mean, see this something. Ab Fab season okay. DVD, <laughs> all of these shakers, but the costume box takes the cake. You have a box, of course. I have a box of costumes. And what places would you wear them? Um, all sorts of things. This is something I wore at a gay party that I love called Horse Meat Disco. Okay. Um, it's a, you know, fun disco shirt and they, uh, you know, it's a party that happens in Brooklyn or throughout the city. It's just like a couple months. Travels the whole world. Um, but, but it's totally on good. like now and then in New York? Yes. So you'd recommend sure. people to go there? Absolutely. Uh, gays in New York are better than anyone in the world at? At being themselves. I think that we have the, you know, most sort of like open, you know, to possibilities. We're always like, you know, we don't have a, a whole persona and everything. I see that in you. <laughs> Facade. We have to go. Well, Alarm yourself. I hear that. Why do you love New York? I love New York because there's an energy here and, um, always something going on that you just can't get anywhere else. Thank you for having us. Thank you for coming. Now enjoy All the right. rest of the day. Bye. Bye.